off out. This doesn't feel like the same mattress I got. I wonder if I got the wrong mattress. Okay, so I just pulled up to Ikea to see if I can find my dresser and bed because they haven't been in stock anywhere and the shipping, they don't even have it shipping and half of the stuff that I want is unavailable. So I'm gonna actually see what is in store first and see if I can just buy it here. Hopefully to fit in my little car. I think it did the last time, I'm not sure. But get Call it back at your girl about Sonya. Double mask and I'm ready to go. Okay guys, this is my favorite room in Ikea. This is exactly how my, ouch, <laughs> my living room would be set up. That crap hurt my back. I love the, I like, I don't know if I like, my favorite color is black, but I just like this modern style, if you wanna say. This is another area, just like that study area. I don't switch the mouse part to this ugly, ugly stuff. Look at this. This is not the bedspread that I wanted. I had fur and everything and the different pillows, and they took it off. I have this stand in black. I thought about going white, but I don't know. Leave a comment and let me know if you guys think I should go white. Here we go. Guys, I was walking around this whole time with my zipper on down. Let's go. That is embarrassing my zipper was down the whole time she didn't even tell me but yeah comment and let me know if you think i should go white or not but this is kind of the vibe i'm currently going for yeah so i gotta find my mattress and then i had it's a long dresser but i can't find the one in stock there's my style again in a different color but let's see if we can find the dresser in the bed Okay, yeah, this is the current one. <laughs> this is one of them, but I don't want to get this because they always say this one's not, see, temporarily unavailable. But this is the style I have in black almost, but I got mine from Target. The one I'm trying to find is just like it. <laughs> this is another mom one. This is the black version. That one's unavailable. <laughs> But it does look lower. So now the problem is, I don't know how I feel with that with my TV on it, because that does look really low. You said what? Is it just black or something? It's black. Yeah, this is just the white version. <laughs> the only thing I don't like about that is because of the, uh, I don't think that's the issue. Because it's low. Yeah, it's low, I know. Oh, it's temporary on the bottom. Yeah, that's what I thought, the black. They have white, but. No. Well, so if I sleep like this, yeah. But my problem is so it's because it's low. Okay. They have these for one time. Oh, these are unavailable too. Why does yeah. everybody decide they want mine? That one's there. So this is unavailable. Okay. Yeah, no, that's there. So this five one's available, but it might look awkward in my space. I bet you wanted a long one though. I do, it just looks so low. Okay, so I think this is the mattress. I'm not gonna get the dresser because they don't have the one I wanted. So it's this brand here. Let's see if they have it in stock. I need to get a cart. Oh, they do have white skin. Funny that.
to do this cool little footage and I can't even find the dog on mattress now. It's not showing in the correct place they told me. So now I'm just gonna hunt to find the mattress. Which are none of these. A few moments later. So I ended up getting the mattress, it's still in Ikea, hopefully you can hear me, but I saw these cool snacks to try. I'm pretty sure, you know, I give you a plug to Amazon, I'm pretty sure these are on Amazon, but I'm going to look, and if they are, there's a link below. But these don't have any corn syrup or anything, gluten free and all that, and I got some peach pear ones. What did you get, a hot dog? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here so you can actually hear me when I take my mask off. Don't worry about that. So as you can see, I just made it back home. I'm about to change back into these bad boys, but you see my bedspread, so I'm gonna take all this off and wash it. Now, let me give you an insight. I've been cleaning my room and decluttering, so I have a huge mess over here. That's my trash bag, and let me show you what's going on with my dressers. You can see the drawers are open, making it look like a huge mess. Let me get you the full picture, can you see? It's caving in, so that's why I'm really trying to get a new mattress. I mean, a new dresser. You can see, look, they don't shut. It'll bounce right back. And it doesn't do that. You see how these are? That's how it's supposed to look. But this side just bounces back. And I don't know if I can put it in. Probably can't see it. Yeah, that's done. But inside there, there's a piece. You're not gonna be able to, that little light, you see that? Like, where's my finger? I do this every time. That little strip, that's actually split in the back panel. So that's why I'm trying to get a new one, but they don't have the style that I want. But let me take all this off and wash it and we'll unroll the new mattress. You guys really don't want to see all this. Let's speed it up. Okay, here's my makeshift with my slack because I broke it. Let's get the new mattress. Don't know how to pronounce IKEA stuff. Morgadal? I have no idea. But there's a number if you guys want to get it. Um, I think this is different than the one I had, but it should work the same. And as soon as I cut this open, the mattress is gonna fly out. So I thought this was a better angle. I'm trying to talk over my humidifier because it is so loud. I gotta get a new one of these. But I'm gonna try to rip this off and pop it open. As you can see, this is all I'm gonna be doing is cutting that out and then it's gonna fold open. But I think the view back over there would be better. Now under here, I do have the storage drawers too if you don't have the mom bed. So I feel like, you know, I was in college in the dorm. So I got my snack drawer and this is my YouTube drawer. And then the winter clothes that I switch out and stuff like that. So this storage is great. The bed still works perfectly fine. Just had to get a new mattress. So let's put this back over there and open it up.
fluff out? Is the question. Feel like the same mattress I got. I wonder if I got the wrong mattress. I'm gonna figure this out and come back. Okay, so turns out I did end up getting a different mattress than the one that I had already. Now I'm gonna put in the screenshots of them. My old mattress was actually cheaper than this mattress that I got, but um, you can see the difference. I believe it's thicker in width, like it sits higher, but I can always get a mattress topper. Now, the reason why I actually picked out this mattress and probably not the old one is because when I went to Ikea, I actually sat down and tried the mattresses and laid back on them. And this one is more firm than the last one, which I believe is something that I needed because I was just sinking in parts and this feels really good. But like I said, I can always get a topper, so that can be another excuse for me to go back to Ikea to get something else again. But this was a little, if you want to say a little tutorial and explanation of one of the best Ikea mattresses and what mattress you should get. This is one that I like, but you should go and try them out to see which one you do like. But let me bring you in closer so you can see the differences. So like I said, these have the straps too, but you can see the width. Like there's that, it's significantly thinner. So it kind of sinks right into my bed frame, which I kind of don't mind. Um, I'm not sure how that's gonna work with my bedspread. I'll try it on and see. But I plan on getting a whole new set anyways that I saw in Ikea. But you saw the width of that compared to, but here you can see the difference in the thickness here. This one felt more thicker, I guess. I don't say softer, but this will probably be better. The more firm one, that way it won't sink in as fast. But, I do like this one. When I have all my pillows and everything, it does feel good, I can say. Yeah, this feels good to me. And if it is too firm, I can always get one of those uh, toppers that have the Tempur-Pedic stuff on it. That one could work. But my stuff is in the washer, so I'll be back when this is done and when I can actually make my bed again. Okay, if I haven't showed you, here's the bed made up. Um, it actually was really comfortable, but I'll talk more on it. This I'm trying to do a journey to see if I spend a couple nights on the bed to see how it would do. And so far, it's been about two nights, and it's been pretty good. But I'll come back on to show you guys in detail and talk to you and tell you everything about it.